Hello, uh, this is Reza Rad from Radacad. In this video, I'm going to show you a very simple tip, but very useful how to enable the formula bar in Power Query and what are good things that uh, would be helpful you can do with that. Uh, let's go and check it out. The formula bar in Power Query is not by default on. That is why I think it is important for everyone to know about it. When you are in Power BI Desktop, when you are in uh, Transform Data, uh, which is Power Query Editor window, of course, you can do all the transformations you want here. Uh, let me just make my screen sharing. Uh, so in Power BI uh, Desktop, when you are in Transform Data, uh, uh, when you look at every query, you can do a lot of transformation at the top or you can do your transformation with right click, but um, you can see the steps that you have used for transformation and you can go to the setting of some of these steps, but some of these steps doesn't really have a setting. For example, uh, here I know that I have removed columns, but I have no idea what columns was that I have removed unless I go and select this step before. So it tells me that this had like this many columns. Now it is removed. And if I want to go and edit it, there is no setting for that. So I have to basically like remove it and add it again. However, if I had formula bar, this was much easier. Formula bar is really simple to add. You can go to the view tab in the uh, Power Query Editor, just enable the formula bar. As soon as you check that checkbox, you will see the formula bar appearing at the top. The formula bar will show the formula for every single step you are looking at, not the entire query. Um, and for example, when I click on remove columns, that then easily will tell me that these are the columns removed. Uh, these three actually, uh, and then I can go and change it. So sometimes it is helpful for changing. Sometimes even if you are not changing anything, it is even um, good for understanding what happened. Like here you understand what columns you have removed. And this is not really complicated to understand for most of the steps, uh, especially if you are not changing it. So make sure that you check this checkbox formula bar. Uh, you just check it once and then it will stay there. Very important, but very useful for your Power BI uh, development. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe into our YouTube channel. We have weekly videos of Power BI and AI. Thank you. Bye.